the Fortria Chase is next. Two more on grade two. Uh, and Judge Anderson's at the top for Joshua Sutherland. Hot Springs Daddy, Vinny Gerard, Jungle Boy, Matt Cooper, San Pedro Tinker, Vinny Gerard, and Hall of Fame, Derek Hinderson. Just five in this. Uh, called in and away. Seems to be this week we've got lots of big fields and one or two small fields as well. So keeps everybody on their toes, keeps things interesting. It's San Pedro Tinker who leads into the first of the 12th. Five runners in this, and Vinnie Gerard's got two of them. They're going pretty quickly as well to get over the second because George Anderson for Joshua Sutherland is almost tailing off. He made a bad mistake at that fence as well. And it is not normal to see a Joshua Sutherland horse that far behind this early in a race. Which makes you think they're either going too quickly or there is something amiss with. George Anderson. But it's San Pedro Tinker who's in the lead. Over number three. All safely over it. And Hot Springs Daddy second. Hall of Fame third. Jungle Boy fourth. And George Anderson ten lengths behind them. In the fifth place as they pass the winning post with a complete circuit to go. And San Pedro Tinker is in the lead by five lengths. To Hot Springs Daddy as they get over this ditch. Then Hall of Fame and Jungle Boy. And then a 10 length gap to Judge Anderson. So, a puzzling events here so far as they make their way down the back part of the track. And over the fifth. Which they all get over. Judge Anderson appears to be going okay within himself. Doesn't seem to be too concerned about being so far behind. They get over the sixth. Carries on that far behind. He'll be in a hunter next week. And San Pedro Tinker in the lead. As they get over the seventh from Jungle Boy second. Then Hot Springs Daddy and Hall of Fame. And then still ten minutes adrift, George Anderson. I think six and a half furlongs to go now. And San Pedro Tinker is in the lead. And Jungle Boy is second. Hot Springs Daddy third. Hall of Fame fourth as they get over the eighth. Anderson not making any ground up at all at the moment. San Pedro Tinker is only leading by two as they get over that ditch. That was number nine. Hall of Fame's moved back into second as Jungle Boy comes under a bit of pressure. Hot Springs Daddy is fourth. And if anything, George Anderson's getting further behind. They get over the tenth. And in fact, he is getting considerably further behind. So I will forget about him, I think. And it's San Pedro Tinker who is heading down to the second last. Gets over that nicely in the lead from Hall of Fame in second. Hot Springs Daddy on the outside is third. Jungle Boy looks nailed on for fourth as they head down towards the final fence. It's Vinnie Gerard against Derek Hinton as they come down towards the final fence. And San Pedro Tinker's been in the lead all the way. Hall of Fame, though, is beginning to just get into the lead. I'm going to come down to the jump, I think, as they get to this final fence and then... Derek Hinton horse jumped it slowly. San Pedro Tinker jumped it quicker on the outside. Now Hall of Fame is trying to get going again, but so too is Hot Springs Danny. It's got to be a 1 2 for Vinnie Gerard this one. San Pedro Tinker wins it. Hot Springs Danny second. Hall of Fame third. Jungle Boy fourth. And Judge Anderson in his own time at the back. Mighty odd run for a Joshua Sutherland horse. Has he accidentally put a three minor in a two mile race or something? I don't know what's happened there. Very odd. Anyway, San Pedro Tinker takes it. For Vinnie Gerard, Hot Springs Daddy. Well, Vinnie Gerard again was second. Hall of Fame, Derek Hinton was third. And Jungle Boy for Matt Cooper was fourth. I think we have got the answer to the mystery of the Joshua Sutherland horse because Judge Anderson for Joshua Sutherland was fifth. And if you look at that rating there, he's rated 100, so he's obviously a hurdler. And he's not run over fences, I think it's pretty clear from that. He's not a two mile chaser. <laughs> 